Vierde maanden, de jongste van het hele pak, wel Robert Matteo Schack, is de oudste deelnemer aan dit uh, toernooi aan het Rolex Belgian International. Hij wordt in januari 40 jaar en hij was ooit de nummer 1 in het gedekt dubbel en top 15 in het hele dubbel. Hij zegt ook dat hij kleiner is dan de Rambo, maar even dodelijk efficiënt. We gaan het allemaal zien. Met vier finales op rij is ons uh, bovenste duo zich weer vol aan het bewijzen. Ze willen zich dus terug profiteren op het hoogste niveau. Ze hebben hier in de halve finale de winnaars van de Europese Spelen in Baku verslagen. De Turkse Turkse, die we dan straks aan de brug gezien hebben in onze eerste finale. Goed, we zijn er zo als klaar voor, dames en heren, voor de Mixed Doubles finale. Tussen Noor van Bergen uit Zweden en Matteo Schack Zima uit Polen. Ready to play. I'm sorry for the students. Can you have two seats? Yes. You receive. Dames en heren, de umpire heeft een probleem, een technisch probleem met het scorebord. De scoremachine dat wordt nu uiteraard zo snel mogelijk opgelost. Wij hopen daarna meteen met de finale van het Mixed Double te kunnen beginnen.
Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Jonathan Nord, Emily Fabecke, Sweden. And on my left, Robert Matuszak, Nadia Stasieva, Poland. <laughs> Nadia Stasieva to serve, to Jonathan Nord, love all, play. And you're very welcome back after our short break to this, the third match of the finals of the 2015 Belgian International here in Leuven. Mixed doubles representing Sweden, Jonathan Nord and Emily Fabeke against the Polish veterans Robert Matuziak and Nadia Zieba. Swedes in white, nearest the camera. The Poles furthest from us in black. Over. One love. Certainly the Swedes, a surprise packet of this tournament. Beat the top seeds, Michael Fuchs and Birgit Mikkels in the semi-final quite easily in the end, 21-19, 21-12. And before that, improving French pair in the quarterfinal, Bastien Kersudi and Lia Palermo. Again in two games, 21-17, 22-20. I've had this remarkable run. Four finals in four tournaments back. After a year and a half out of the game as a partnership. Nadia, of course, having a baby in that interim period. Little boy, now a year and a half old. Three, love. And Robert Matuzzi at quarters is saying that was the longest year and a half in his badminton life. hard to believe that the veteran pole will be 40 on his next birthday in January. And the goals are still the same. They're here and they want to qualify for the Rio Olympics next summer. They know that they have had a late start. Or love. But this is their fourth final in succession. Two victories lost their opening final when they came back from their year and a half out. The White Knights actually beaten by the Irish pair. Oh. So Sam and Tony McGee on that occasion. Service so over. One, four. Difficult pair to play against, very unorthodox in many ways. European champions from 2012, of course, in Karlskrona in Sweden. Two, four. And a jump smash from the athletic Methusiak following up. He keeps his body in prime, pristine position, condition has done all his badminton in life and that's what he accredits his Four. longevity to. Three, four. Smash right into the body of Jonathan. Some more. And again, you notice the caption in the top left hand corner. Little tennis ball denoting the scores. Hopefully, one day, Babington will be as popular as tennis. 
And we get our own little uh, shuttlecock moving back and forward across the scoring graphic. But for now, we have to make do with a tennis ball from the host broadcaster. So it's over. Five, all. Super shot. Come here. Come here. So over. Six, five. Jonathan, a little bit of nerves Six on both old. sides of the net in the early part of this mixed doubles final. Routine, should have been a routine push down the line. And Jonathan North. Sarah Fox, the enthusiast. Ah, excellent shot in behind from the Swedes. Sorry, Not of approval from Emily Fabeke. Seven, six. Super shot from the experienced Swede. Spent much of her career, of course, playing women's doubles. Alongside Emma Wengberg. Eight, six. Long from Matusiak. Poor serve, so really. Over. Plenty of air over the net. Seven, eight. There to be attacked. Yeah, easily attacked and pushed back into the body. Good instinctive interception from Nadia Zieva. Eight, nine. Serve from Matusiak. Yes! So it's over. Ten, eight. Moving slightly to one side. The service receiver, of course, has to be able to see the shuttle on, on, on service. 
just a nice aggressive punch clear from Zeba. Yes. A little bit lazy yes. from Robert. 11-8, interval. It's a three-point advantage at the interval, 11-8 for the Swedes, <laughs> Norden, <laughs> Quebec. <laughs> Wat het wordt, gaan de Zweden uithalen of kunnen de Polen de zaken nog opdraaien? Zo meteen het vervolg van het eerste keer. Twenty seconds. Twenty seconds. Thank you, coach. Please, coach. Eleven eight. Play. the Swedes have got the best of the early exchanges. Constant discussions between Matusiak and Zira. Hold. Again. Service over. Below average serve from Jonathan North. 9, 12. The shuttle returned with something on it right back into the face of the Swedish player. Hold. And those instinctive reactions around the net from Zeba. 10, 12. Such a tall, imposing figure at the net. Originally from Belarus, of course. Hey! So it's over. 13 10. Good vision from North. 14-10. Change of tactic with the flick serve. Polish pair. Service over. 11 14. Jonathan Nord and Emily Fabeke, of course, battling for the number one spot in Sweden. Nico Wuppenen and Amanda Hogstrom. Yes. Service over. 15. 11. Yes! Super play from Jonathan Noll. He's certainly 16, 11. this match really well. Looking very comfortable.
much better so at this 17 11. really after the interval the swedish pair have seized the moment leading 11 8 at the interval now it's 17 11 odds on to take the opening game First of all, Norden then going cross court for the winner. 18 11. See the shake of the head from Robert Matusiak, very uncharacteristic. The veteran Paul. Yeah, there's that shake of the head. Service over. Indecision from Jonathan Nord. Well, 19. Thought about leaving it. Yes! Again, a poor shot from so Matusia. Over. 20 game point. 12. Just 16 minutes. It's the Swedes who reach game point. Robert Matusiak winning that shuttle to clip the line. Guys, on the drop from Matusiak. He's got the spark with the pole of knee. 20. You could see both the Swedes stepping back, expecting the full smash. Oh, great vision again from Matusiak. Angle cross court for the winner. 15, 20. service in the end handing the first game to the Swedes first game 21 15 Jonathan Nord Emily Fabeke 21 15 certainly a run of five or six points <laughs> after the interval Set the Swedes on their way. But certainly you could see towards the end of that game with two seconds here, but just started to find a little bit of form. Is there a bijscholingsdag? Badminton behind the scenes for iedereen die iets met badminton te maken heeft. Alle informatie over die bijscholingsdag op badmintonvlaanderen.be. En op 22 november zijn er de Vlaamse kampioenschappen in Kortrijk. Ook daarover alle info op badmintonvlaanderen.be. Zometeen tweede game in deze mixed doubles finale tussen het Zweedse duo Noord van Becke en het Poolse duo Mateusz Ziba.
20 seconds. 20 seconds. Second game. Love all. Play. Welcome back, second game on the way. Let's see what the polls so, so can bring to the second game. One, love. Certainly. Certainly the Swedish pair dominant in that opening set. Jonathan Nord very effective from the rear court. Flick serve from Matusiak. But at that time, straight smash and then the cross smash for the winner with a forehand hip of Emily Fabecki. Two love. This from Matusiak and Zieba seizing the initiative right from the outset in the second game. Good return of serve from Jonathan Nord. Clipping the net court, forcing the lift. Service over. One, One three. And if there's been a weak point in Jonathan's game today, so it's over. Four, one. Good serve. You could see again Robert Matusiak attacking the serve. Hello. Oh. Nord forced to play the shuttle off the deck. Good rally, crowd love it. Persistent from the poles. This one to smash right back into the recovery. Nord, no chance for the Swede. Beckett, experienced player, of course, leading the discussions between the Swedish pair. A lot of sweat on the court. Seven degrees in the arena. Okay. Large crowd, certainly one of the largest crowds I see year on year on the Bank of Europe circuit. And off to the players left, large VIP area. Yeah, 
Uh, patient play from the Swedes. Sammy Silva. Two, five. Straight smash. Intercepted cross court from Emily Fabeke for the winner. Play. Seven, two. Seven, two. Seven, two. Seven, two. In favor of the Polish pair, Tuziak and Zieba. Norden Fabeki already won sent to the good. Taking the opening game, 21-15, 26 minutes gone. Again, oh. great interception from that imposing figure of Nadia Zieba. Eight, the net. two. That's a good start to the second game for the Polish pair. Frustration from Emily. Turning the shuttle via the rafters. Fault. Service fault called. First service fault in the match. Service called. over. Three nine. The poles are so comfortable. Ten, and you see three. at the rear court. And Matusiak hunting the net. They're as comfortable with the woman at the rear as they are with the man. Beautiful backhand winner. 11 3. Interval. Super start for Matusiak and Zieba, leading 11 3 at the interval. One game in favor of Norden Fabeke. Seconds, twenty seconds. You can certainly see in the face of Emily Fabeke a considerable amount of frustration as she's discussing tactics with her partner. Mentally, the poles well ahead in this game. Eleven three. Play. Over 
Service over. 12 4. The poles have certainly grown into this match. Easy winner on the replay. Again, that look of disdain from Emily. Great smash down the middle, causing the problems. 13 4. Fourteen four. That's how you know Robert Matusiak has arrived in the match. Plays a shot, plays a winner, Play and rushes to the net to pick up the dead shuttle and get the next rally underway as soon as possible. Fifteen four. Yeah. Emily, Emily, please come to me. Please. Last warning. Last warning for Emily for Beckett for delaying play. Really fantastic play in the Polish woman. for Emily. Good anticipation. Read the situation. Anticipated 17, the four. But his second game, certainly one-way tra traffic. 33 minutes gone. 17-4. The Poles lead. Raced into a three-love lead and really have never looked back in this second game. Hold. Service over. Five. Seventeen. Yeah, poor lift from Nadia. She knew that. She Only three quarters court. And onto the forehand side of Jonathan Nord. He was never going to make a mistake. Breaking concentration Six, really for the Polish 17. pair. Service over. 18 6. Judgment from Emily. Game point. Matusiak and Ziba. <laughs> oh. Game. And Jonathan Nord trying to leave the shuttle in the end. Hits it. Point. 
to the polls. Second game Second won by game. Robert Matuszak, Nadezhda Sieva, 21-6. The umpire says... One game all. Second game to Matuszak and Sieva, 21-6, one game all. Winnen met 21-6. Het tweede game dat betekent, dames en heren, dat we voor het eerst vanavond een finale hebben die zal bestaan uit drie games. Zo meteen dus het allesbeslissende game in deze mixed double finale tussen Noord en Van Benke aan de ene kant en Matteo Jacques Ziba aan de andere kant. Als u zin hebt gekregen om het zelf eens te proberen, dit badminton, dan moet u op 5 en 6 december in het Rooi in Bergen zijn. Voor het Badminton Festival 5 en 6 december, dus op het Rooi in Berchem. Alle informatie op badmintonvlaanderen.be. Wij maken ons klaar voor het beslissende derde keer in deze mixed double finale. Seconds, 20 seconds. Please, all players, come to me, please. Come to me, please. So that's the deciding please third no. game. Keep up the speed with receiving and shot serving. Thank you. The umpire calling in both pairs to warn them. Keep Final the speed game. between the rallies. Level play. What variation from Enthusiac. One love. Smash, and you see him rushing here. The soft little net. Rally from all four players. From the north, out on the back of his back. Oh. Really inspired play from the poles. Good smash into the body of Fabeke. North at full stretch. And then the winner cross court. Excellent play from Zieba. Pose currently at 98th in the world, but that's just after four tournaments played. Three tournaments played, of course. This is their fourth since coming back together after a year and a half hiatus. The goal is to qualify for Rio and also see what they can achieve at the European Championships next year in France. Service over. One. Two. The European Mixed Doubles Champions from 2012, of course. Incidentally, that was in Sweden. Ah. Oh. And again, the accuracy of the smash into the body. Service over. Three, one. 
slow to get back into the defensive position. Textbook backhand net kill from Matusiak. 4 1. Service over. Two, four. Perfectly placed in the Swedes, but at the same time, it's a little bit of indecision and breakdown in communication from the Polish pair. Players, please back on court. Service over. Five, two. I think the Poles got a little bit lucky. Wasn't the deepest flick serve two. in the world. Matusiak, 40 years of age in January. Good playing with the enthusiasm of a 20 year old. And his dedication to the sport has really been phenomenal over the years. I think I'm right in saying if he did happen to qualify for the Rio Olympics, it would be his fifth Olympic Games. And by any measure, that it would be a phenomenal achievement. Eight, two. Service over. Three, nine. It's getting towards do or die time now for the Swedes. Trading by six in this deciding set. Really need to put some pressure on Matusiak and Ziva. Needs a good serve here from Emily Fabeke. That's decent from the Swedish girl. Oh. Easy smash winner. No, but a good serve from Quebec. Four, nine. Forcing the high and short lift. Easy winner. Serve from Quebec. From Kuziak. Service over. Ten four.
Oh, again, the interception from Ziba. 11-4. Exceptional. Change ends in the polls. Change of ends, of course, in the third set. 11-4, 45 minutes gone. Looking good for the polls. Twenty seconds, twenty seconds. Robert needs to serve. Eleven four. Play. So eleven four, really. Swedes have to and need to. Service over. Get a foothold in this third and deciding side. Five, eleven. Misjudgment from Matusiak. The lift clearly landing inside the baseline. And the Swedes now need a run of points in the serve of Jonathan Nord. They really need to make a pole's work for this win. Yes. Six, eleven. And that's the reply they needed. Two quick points after the interval. serves from Jonathan Nord in this match. Really handing the attacking opportunity to the Polish pair. <laughs> yeah, Matusiak likes it. 13-6. Great vision again. On a veteran pole. Yes. Thirteen six. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Setting up in defense, the smash down the middle. 14 7.
Nicole from Matusiak is here, but believe it. 15 7. Looking very comfortable now, the poles. Sixteen, seven. 16, seven. And the Swedes have not been in front since winning the first game. Loose shot from Jonathan North. Seventeen seven. Polish within four points of the Emily, Belgian international Emily, title. Please, please come to me. Another little talking to for Emily Fibeke. Card been branded this time. And she has been warned a few times already, of course. And that's certainly going to be the nail in the coffin. Seven. I don't know how they call it misconduct, but uh, certainly delaying play. 18 7. Service over. 8 18. Sir, I'm doing all the good work of the previous point. 19-8. 20 match point. Eight. And in 52 minutes, it's match point for Zieba and Matusiak. Yeah, routine Eight. and there it is. And Robert Matusiak and a big smile from Nadia Zieba and they've been outstanding this week. And European badminton is certainly better. Having Matusiak and Zieba back on the circuit, what a fantastic pair. They have been and continue to be for Poland. Commiserations for the Swedes. Norden for Becky, that time will come again, but for now, it's Match in three games. Match by Robert Matuszak, Nadia Robert Stasieva, Matusiak, Nadia, Nadia 15, Zieva, 21, winners, 21, the 2015 Belgian International eight. Mixed Double. Thank you. 15, 21, 21, 6, 21, 8. 15, 21, 21, 6 and 21, 8 for Matuszak Ziba out of Poland tegen our Swedish friends. Wij wachten hem even op voor een kort gesprek en dan natuurlijk de prijsuitreiking, de podiumceremonie. En hier zijn ze dan, dames en heren, Robert Mateuszak en Nadjeda Ziba, de winnaars van het Mixed Double. Robert, please. What does this uh, victory mean to you? Uh, after two years break, uh, we didn't play last two years with Nadia. I just uh, wait for her. So for the beginning, like we just play already four tournaments, and four times we play in the final, three times winning. So it's a great feeling, of course. Nadia, you're in great shape together. Fourth final in a row, third victory. Yeah, we wait a long time for, for this match. 
and uh, I want to communicate this victory for my son. Oké, okay. uh, Robert zei daarnet dat hij gewacht heeft op uh, Nadia om uh, terug te keren om uh, al die finales te kunnen spelen. Dus in vierde finale op rij hun uh, derde overwinning. Robert, you're almost 40, but you seem younger than ever when we see you playing. Yes, uh, maybe first set, like you see, like uh, old, old engine, I need to warm up a little bit longer. So, but still I feel my, keep my speed, so it's the more important for me. How far can you go? How, how far? At least one year. <laughs> hij gaat nog één jaartje doorspelen, zegt hij. Hij heeft wat meer tijd nodig om in de wedstrijd te komen. Is een beetje een diesel op zijn veertigste, maar het komt allemaal uh, goed. Nadia, what's the next uh, goal for you two? Uh, we actually, we don't know yet. <laughs> But I think for sure Bulgari and uh, Dutch and French. Ze hebben nog een paar toernooien waar ze naar uitkijken, maar een echt doel is er op dit ogenblik nog niet. Onze winnaars Robert Mateuschak en Adjesda Ziba. Dan gaan we ons meteen ook klaarmaken voor de podiumceremonie. En alle kinderen die al staan te wachten op handtekeningen, dat gaat hier nog even duren, zo meteen. Maar eerst moeten we de trofee natuurlijk nog uitreiken. En de eerste trofee wordt uitgereikt door Thomas van Oppes, gemeenteraadslid van de stad Leuven. Zit ook in de commissie sport van de stad Leuven. Ze hebben een eervolle finale gespeeld, maar toch duidelijk verloren, dames en heren, uit Zweden. Jonathan Noort en Emily Fabekke. Thomas van Oppens, gemeenteraadslid van de stad Leuven, zetelt in de commissie sport, reikt de trofee uit. Zijnde een check, doos pralines, Belgian chocolates en een goede fles leffe. Zolang ze die maar niet in één keer opdrinken, zal het wel goed komen, zeker. Dames en heren uit Zweden, Jonathan Noorden en Emily Fabekke. En dan de winnaars van het mixed double van het elfde Jonix Belgian International from Poland, Robert Mateuschak en Nadjesda Ziba. <applaus> Erik van der Heijden, de schepen van Sport van de Stad Leuven, gaat alles uitreiken. Een check, de pralines, de flesleffen en ook de fonskes. Die uh, Leuven als studentenstad voorstellen. Voilà, heel huids bij onze Poolse winnaars geraakt. En handen tekort. Voilà, dames en heren, het podium van het mixed double toernooi met de runners-up Jonathan Noort en Emily Fabekke uit Zweden. En de winnaars uit Polen, Robert Mateuschak en Nadjesda Ziba. En zo meteen de vierde finale van deze 11 editie van het Yonex Belgian International.
Guys, many congratulations. Uh, three from four, phenomenal record. Great to be back, big smiles on your faces. A little bit of a slow start, but in the end you did it, Nadia. It's always our problem uh, first set. Yeah. Then, then, but after that, it's uh, actually every time it starts to be our, our speed. You're like a diesel engine. You take a little bit of time to warm up. I think it's, that's fair enough. You may be a little bit disappointed with your performance in that first game. Yeah, a little bit, but I was not really afraid because I know, um, like you say, old, old engine, old diesel engine have to be a little bit warm up longer and longer. But after, if, the, if, if this engine start for 100, work starts for 100%, then you see it's working. So that's why, that's why, of course, a little bit afraid after the first game uh, because we lose too easy many mistakes that just that way but after we start to play again like our we use our speed and this is it was the, the key you know it's a little bit unusual your style of mixed a little bit unorthodox you you're as comfortable at the back and you're as comfortable comfortable at the forward as Nadi is and some couples just find that difficult to play against yeah but uh, i always like play like that because it's also a big surprise for our opponent then it's uh, sometimes very easy point our, this is our also weapon because we change a lot. Yeah. Nadia go to the back, then I keep the net, and then we change again. So I think it's uh, our weapon. Weapon. It keeps them thinking, guys. Congratulations, getting to be allowed here. Good crowd here. Great tournament to win, and uh, look forward to seeing you a few more times over the coming months. Well done. Thank you. Well done. Super. Thanks. Thanks.